three astronauts will be involuntarily extending their stay aboard China's Tiangong space station after space debris appears to have struck their return vessel. The Shenzhou-20 crew were planning on heading home on November 5th after a handover period with the Shenzhou-21 crew, who arrived on October 31st. But early in the day, it was announced that their return would be postponed. An analysis to determine the extent of the damage has begun, but if anything is deemed unsafe, the crew will likely come home using the relief crew's return module, and a standby vessel will replace that one. This is not the first time debris has disrupted space operations. In 2023, the Chinese station's solar panels were damaged after being struck by debris, causing a partial power outage. And the Canadarm2 robotic arm, part of the ISS, has sustained damage after being struck several times. The ISS itself is often repositioned to avoid large pieces of debris. Some experts have expressed concern that as the number of spacecraft surrounding our planet increases, we could reach a point where low Earth orbit becomes too hazardous to occupy. This is known as the Kessler syndrome and has prompted the space industry to look into how we can begin removing space junk.